Hello from the future state. That was terrible. I'm sorry, but I'm not taking it back. My name is Kyle Souza. My blog is TalkingGeek.com, and this video is about DC Future State. This is the free preview uh, handed out at the end of 2020, so not really a free comic book day giveaway, uh, but free comic book day 2020 didn't really happen. This is uh, not even really a preview, just kind of some information about the DC Future State event happening in January and February of 2021 and March. A little bit coming out in March. So I know this video is coming out after a lot of this stuff has already come out. But this is when I got to it. My apologies. Usually I get to things years after they happen. So we've got, we've got a really cool cover showcasing a lot of different characters. I'd call them heroes, but they're not necessarily all heroes. But for the most part, they're heroes, right? For the most part, we've got Zatanna, Connor Kent, Immortal Wonder Woman, Grifter, Aquaman, who's Jackson Hyde, the next Batman, Superman, being Clark Kent, Swamp Thing, Wonder Woman, being Yara Floor, Catwoman, Harley Quinn, Red X, Saturn Girl, Black Racer, Blast Boy, Batman, being Bruce Wayne, Green Lantern as Jon Stewart, Superman as Jonathan Kent, Duo, Damsel, Bouncing Boy, and Brainiac 5, Protex, Phantom Girl, and The Flash. That's right. You got Connor Kent, Clark Kent, and Jonathan Kent. Lots of Kents. So what is Future State? Future State is a look into the future of DC set anywhere. We've got a nice timeline in here starting in 2025 and extending to the end of time but it extends uh rather uh fluidly through 2070 and then we get a big time jump to 3000 and 4500 and then an even larger time jump to the year 82,020, and then a time jump to the end of time with the immortal wonder woman and this little preview is, is information. It is a look at some of the artwork and summaries of the stories. And so we get some interesting stuff. I'll also look at the, the writers here that are doing it. We've got lots of cool writers. Each of them have some writing credits. A couple of them are supernatural writers you know, for the show. A lot of them have other DC credits in their history. It looks like uh, mostly men, but there are a few females in there, or women. And then we've got some artwork. So we've got a stripped down, no pun intended, Superman there. Very different look to him. Stole that joke from, uh, from the book itself. We got some really cool looking Wonder Woman and Batman in there. And so a lot of this is kind of the sunsetting of the heroes we know uh, the progress of the young heroes we know now being older and new heroes coming onto the scene and assuming the mantles of the heroes that we are familiar with we do get some panels though most if not all of them are not final art a lot of it's not even colored in some more there got the flash one down the bottom there he's got a gun which is interesting not, not something he normally has at least when he's the flash uh, or even as a as a csi but as a detective he definitely did and so we've we've got several stories here here's some great artwork first lineup of artwork and we've got if i counted correctly 24 storylines maybe 23 storylines across again if i counted correctly uh 56 different issues so most of the issues are one of two there are a few uh three and four issue arcs and there's at least one one shot in there but most of them are two story arcs about this it looks pretty cool looks pretty interesting i 
will probably wait myself till there's a graphic novel that collects all of them and then I will grab that might be across a couple books might be a big thick book DC does some does some thick collections there omnibus of some sort but if you're interested in reading these when they come out please make it down to your local bookstore pick them up and they they might even have some back issues in there if you missed you know the first round from january since this video is probably coming out uh or is coming out in february so you can get it the swamp thing swamp thing just looks crazy in there see that i have terrible lighting but swamp thing looks crazy so yeah, it, it'll be interesting to see what they do with these stories. I'm looking forward to it. Check out your local comic book shop. And if you don't have a local comic book shop, maybe I have an affiliate link uh, in this video to them online somewhere. Maybe I don't. I haven't looked yet. My name is Kyle Souza. My blog is talkinggeek.com, and I appreciate your time. Thanks for watching.